Hello and welcome to another Ben Builds. This one's going to be a little bit different. Um, so I'm going to basically be building my first workshop. So the first thing I've got to do is just clear off all this junk. I'm going to just throw it into a different room. And then this little area, I'm going to design out into my perfect workshop. So I just had uh, a fun idea. Um, so I've got myself a... Xbox Connect. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to scan this space um, and it should give me actually accurate measurements of the space itself and although it's just two walls it'll be fun to like play around with this kind of technology. So here I'm using the Connect for Windows Developer Toolkit uh, which is a very interesting piece of software um, and it has all these um, kits inside of it. Um, so what I'm using here is the Connect Fusion Explorer and here we've got the um, 3D being generated as I was looking at it, uh, and the live 3D in the corner. Um, so if I point at the wall here, you can see that it's got a really good idea of the, where the wall is. And here we have a live, perfect reconstruction of whatever I'm looking at, which is really super interesting. Uh, occasionally it will make a few little mistakes, so you can see it's made a few little mistakes on there because I moved it too quickly, so I can just reset and move slowly and fully record the space in front of me, which is awesome. So I've done a design of the space. Um, and so with just a click of my fingers, this is the workshop I'm calling the Tinkatorium. So we've got a lovely little desk area here. Um, so I've got my soldering iron here with some boxes for lots of little parts. And man, do I feel like a weatherman right now. And then just here, I've got my 3D printer and all the spools underneath the cupboards. Um, and these two units I've just found on Amazon. So I just mocked them up in the 3D, put them in the space, um, and then saw what I needed to do. I'd quite like to do something with this space, this wall here, up until the unit. Um, and I've got the plug socket, so I need to, it's still free. So, what I'd quite like to do with this space is add uh, a whiteboard or some kind of uh, place I can just make notes uh, and really make use of this area. I also do actually plan to make this Tinkatorium sign, uh, but that will probably be in another video. So now I'm just going to all of these two units, uh, put it together and make the space my own. Three days later. Everything has arrived. So we've got the shelving over here, I believe, and then we've got the workbench over here. So it's just time to assemble. So I've got a pretty major problem <laughs> I'm going to have to try and fix. See this here? Oh, I do it this way. You can see that this, this isn't straight. <laughs> got one hole here and then, oh, and that one drops down there. So what this means is nothing is fitting right now. So I'm going to probably do a little bit of drilling, pick this up, and then hopefully it'll go together. First part of the build is done. We've got the workbench. Look at how fancy that's looking. It's a little bit wobbly, um, but I might just uh, shear off a few of the um, few of the bolts and things, and then it'll be done. Now next, I've got to assemble the shelves. And so once that, oh, sh I wasn't talking to you, Alexa. I wasn't talking to you. <laughs> Next, I've just got to assemble the shelves and then the hardware side of this is done and I can focus on making it look pretty. Now the great thing about these shelves is they have little slits at four centimetre intervals all the way up the unit. Uh, so you can put the shelves anywhere you want from top to bottom. Yeah. So there we have all the furniture set up in the workshop. Now it's just time to set all my kit up on the workshop, and put some boxes on the shelves and make it all look pretty. So it's been a few months since I assembled the workshop, uh, so it's definitely a massive mess at the moment. Um, but it obviously means it's been being used a lot. 
What I'm finding most useful is this pegboard at the back where I can just put up all my tools and they're all there, just to hand whenever I need them. I've added a little lamp here so I can, whoop. I'm starting to get to a place where it's all organized, but I'm not quite there yet. I did end up adding a whiteboard to this wall, which is very, very useful. So I can just make notes um, and little diagrams whenever I'm thinking of an idea. Thank you for watching this video. In the coming months, I hope to make a lot more Ben builds, making good use of this lovely workshop. So subscribe to be kept up to date with those. See you soon.